It's interesting to reflect on how the BRC has evolved over 10 years. Uh, in the last cycle of the BRC, our focus was really shifting the activity that we supported towards early phase trials, pulling through discovery science from UCL, working in partnership with SMEs in the UK to deliver that science into innovative medicines and innovative diagnostics in clinical practice at UCLH. year or so we've seen major launches of uh, companies spun out from the partnership of UCL with UCLH a lot of that underpinned by the translational infrastructure supported by the BRC and what we want to see is more of that and in this cycle of the BRC our focus is really on uh, translational research if we look at our feedback this year from our annual report from NIHR, we can see that um, the UCLH BRC and its partnership with UCL is number one in many, if not most, of the key metrics. And it really reflects the tremendous work being done by all of those who are supported by the BRC.